What's good, YouTube? It's your boy Davis, man. Thank y'all for dropping by. Hopefully, y'all enjoy your time here. Now that all the Bills videos are done and everyone's come to the realization that we're not gonna be able to change our six, it completely crossed my mind that I actually still have some exclusive NBA 2K20 footage. I kind of feel at this point like the demo just got a feel of how the gameplay is because every single build that has come out is gonna be possibly useless if custom pie charts are added to the game. But anyway, first things first. At Community Day, I got an opportunity to see which dribble moves were in the game. And actually, here they are. This is NBA 2K20 dribble moves. As you guys can see on the screen, they look quite identical to NBA 2K19's dribble moves, except there's a whole bunch of things missing. A lot of the actual size of combinations are not in NBA 2K20, but when you actually go in game, you can actually still do them, which kind of had me confused. In 2K19, this move was called a size up double behind the back. In 2K20, I don't see that as an option in the store, but it's clearly still in the game. I'm not 100% sure, but possibly with the new dribble style thing, that is a new feature they added to 2K20 that might have some of the things that were removed kind of bundled in together. I'm not 100% sure though, that's a guess. You guys see, I didn't even spend that much time going through each and everything because I expected that to be in the demo, so that's my bad 100%. But you guys see there's tons of different varieties of them and I didn't even scroll down. There's so many more options that are gonna be available for dribble style, so I'm actually super excited to see exactly what that is. Now at Community Day, since I did see that the actual dribble moves in the game were the same, I started practicing. Here's the game versus knowing I'm Harden, he's Giannis, and as you guys can see, I cooked this dude Pretty good, yo. I'm not gonna lie to you, alright? That's my favorite move right there. So you guys can see that's nothing in comparison to the long spin back that I used to do in NBA 2K19. And I don't even know if that move is replicable. I, I tried to do it a little bit in the actual 2KU. You guys see, I did it with Fred Van Vliet. And I don't know, I did a lot of running back here. I mean, it still has a little bit of a, a space opener, but I'm excited to see if it actually still as effective as it was last year, bro. Fred Van Vliet has never been used this much in 2K, bro, I'm telling you. Another thing that I noticed is while it's easier for guards to cook centers, as you see, you get punished for reaching in this clip right here. Like like Giannis did. You have a massive mismatch. Like you guys see, this dude is able to go past me every time. Now I did see Baluba tweet about how blow bias are gonna be nerfed a lot and they're gonna be brought down and that they can actually change them on site this year, which is actually extremely important. I'm happy about that. But this dude was going crazy on me, but it makes sense though at the same time, because Giannis would go crazy on Harden in the paint. Like, let's just be realistic. I was actually able to lock down Giannis a little bit better when I pulled out Kawhi, but those are the only few players that I tested out guarding him. So Giannis is like, Giannis is goaded anyway, bro. Now, one thing I did go into detail is the moving crossover, and this kind of just, and it kind of very Verifies to me that the, like, some of these moves are pretty much the exact same. So that's why I was going into experimenting immediately with some of the moves I did in 2K19. Same thing with behind the backs. I went through those. You guys will be able to recognize them. As y'all can see, I'm moving extremely slow on it just for the fact that my player wasn't upgraded here. I did end up upgrading my player afterwards. But you guys see the behind the backs moving crossover. This is actually how you upgrade your player in the actual game right here. As you guys can see, you guys see how all the upgrades are going to work. Now, this looks completely different from the actual demo now one thing that caught me off guard while i was going through the animations i saw the park things i was like yo you bro, i gotta check this out yo now you guys see a lot of this is the same but something that caught me off guard is trike and tandem i don't think we've ever had that in a 2k now as i'm looking tandem is something that you can do together i don't know if that's like a tandem bike but those are just tandem animations you walk around and stand in the neighborhood. I'm not 100% sure, so y'all can educate me in the comment section. I'll be dropping people off and then riding my tricycle past them. Now, unfortunately, I actually couldn't see the trikes animations. I'm assuming it's because I wasn't a high enough whatever the rep system or the overall system is was. But yeah, man, uh, that's pretty much the end of that. I've been experimenting with NBA 2K20 dribbling so much, and I think there's a lot of potential to go crazy, yo. I've seen tons of people showing off crazy clips on Twitter, and the game's only been out for a few days, and we can't even use our own animation. Now, in terms of my thoughts on the 2K20, I enjoyed it a lot. I think that blow by should be fixed a little bit, but Mike Wayne already said he's on that. I don't know how I feel about custom pie charts, bro, because like, what stop people from giving lockdown shoots and Hall of Fame badges and, yo, I don't know, it could possibly go south or if everyone just makes go to builds, it could go good, right? But I just wanted to drop this video because I realized that no one has showed which actual sigs are in the game. And there's a new area for dribbling called dribble style. So, uh, y'all know I never do like recording or news videos. So, and this is a rare one, I right? That's gonna wrap it up for today's video. Um, this is pretty much all I want to cover today. If you're new to the channel, make sure you subscribe to your boy. Thank you guys so much for the support. It's been amazing. Your boy Davis, I'm out. Peace.